We just made this a rustic lantern for like 25 bucks. Yep, it'll hold all your holiday goods. You can use it at Halloween to hold your pine cones and your pumpkins, mini pumpkins. It'll hold your Christmas balls at Christmas time. Or you can just put a little candle in there and it'll glow and light up your front porch so Garrett doesn't trip walking out the front porch. What is up? Welcome back. Do you like to do a build it or make it? A great, uh, that's what we do on this channel every week. This week, we're making a lantern. It's getting dark out early and I don't need a slip and fall accident on my stairs. That is not why we're making this lantern. <laughs> this lantern is gonna be decorative for our front porch and it's gonna be used for the fall. I'm gonna put some pumpkins and pine cones in it and this little glass vase pillar thing or Christmas balls. It's, it's gonna look really cute. Dual purpose. Dual purpose. Step one. They call you cuts. <laughs> we picked up a one by 12 and a pressure tree two by two, and a scrap piece of one by eight. And we just cut them up so that the frame would fit around this glass tube thing. Tube thing. <laughs> Step two, assembly. We're gonna bring it all together, make it whole. <laughs> because a two by 12 is really expensive, really expensive, we picked up a one by 12, and we're gonna glue it together to make it look thicker. To make sure they stay in place while the glue dries, I'm gonna throw a one inch brad in it. The nail, not the guy. <laughs> Bam! Two by 12. A lot cheaper too. Now we're gonna put the frame together. Switching nails. I got a two inch nail. We got two sides of the frame. Two sides. All right, the frame is all together. Looks great. Looks great. Looking great. <laughs> Whoa. Now we're gonna attach it to the top and bottom of those two by 12s. Let's make sure this cylinder will fit. All right, let me double check your math here. Look at that. Perfect. 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 Now we're gonna add the top and the bottom. Remember our faux two by 12s? some glue on the bottom and then we'll line it up. Yeah, let's do that. You got a measuring stick? A measuring stick. Woo! <laughs> going in. Should I do two or just one? Just one. You're nail crazy. All right, I'll glue this real quick. All right, 
now we need the decorative top pieces. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We got this little one by eight piece. No worries, this is gonna go on it. How's that going on? You just gluing it? Just glue it. But you know what I don't know is how are you going to put this? So we got this little um, bun foot, which would be used for a sofa or something. Um, but we're going to use it as a finial to go right on top. So cute. But you're going to have to maybe drill, well, yeah, let's drill a hole or something. Find center. I'll get the drill. Okay. Really, just, yeah, I think that's the way to do it. I'm just gonna drill a hole the same size. I'll put a little glue, a little glue yes. in the hole. Yes, we're on the same page, babe. Bam, steeple! <laughs> no, what? So oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I thought you were gonna glue the inside of the hole. <laughs> My bad. No. Perfect. All right. <gasps> that looks so cute. That's what we got so far. Yeah, let's put this thing in there. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go stain it. Where are we staining it? Briar smoke. We're gonna go stain it briar smoke. We'll see you guys on the other side. All right, we decided it was a little flat, so we're gonna add these little tiny feet out of the two by two, and then we're done. All right, all done. Yeah, it looks good. It looks great. All let's right. Put your, let's put our little cylinder in it. Perfect, it's yeah, just perfect. All right, let's go put some stuff in it and put it on the front porch. So, let's do it. All right, good job, babe. If you like this week's project, give us a like, leave us a comment, tell us how you're going to make one, tell us that you're going to make a taller one or a smaller one. Don't forget to look us up on all the social medias, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, oh, and we just fired up a Patreon page. Until next week. <laughs>